Best band. Hey everyone, I'm Eric. Uh, I'd like to thank Hugh and Samantha for inviting me to their wedding and stay on the honor of the Hugh's best band. Um, I met a few of your students at Sadler at Prep, which is a golf and tennis academy in Tampa. He was in the golf program, and I was in the tennis program, and he was one of my first uh, friends at school. Hugh was a true gentleman and a really bright guy. In fact, he was a teacher's pet, <laughs> always being commended by school faculty and the golf instructors. And when we had the award ceremony at the end of every semester, it was always Hugh who was being asked to come to the podium and accept the awards for highest GPA, best golfer. He even made valedictorian. But don't let that impress you too much. There are only 12 in our graduating class. Since grade school, our friendship has spanned competitive ping pong matches, the occasional round of golf, flying around in airplanes, eating grouper sandwiches at Frenchies in Clearwater Beach, and sharing our ambitions to go pro golf or tennis and retire in Naples. <laughs> no matter where you are in life, no matter what you're working on or where you're going, Hugh always makes the effort to reach out to see how you're doing, and that's a real friend. Hugh, your beautiful new wife, Samantha, is perfect for you. She's kind, generous, smart, enjoys traveling, watches football, and is always there to support you. Samantha, you have a great man to look forward to spending the rest of your life with. He's intelligent and honorable, and I know he's a rock to for you to lean on. Also, I want to praise you on your endeavors as you begin your new career as a teacher. It's a noble career, and I know you will absolutely enjoy it. So, I treasure your friendship, and I look forward to many more fantastic memories. Please join me in raising a glass and toasting this young couple and wishing them a bright and happy future. Cheers, and let's give it up for the newlyweds. Next up, we've got Cheryl, the maid of honor. I have had the pleasure of knowing Samantha for 13 years, and if you ask her, she'll tell you that she absolutely couldn't stand me when she first met me. <laughs> In fact, she wanted to quit her job because of me. But she quickly realized that I am one of the coolest persons ever, and we formed a friendship that to me turned into more of another sister for me and my siblings, and a daughter to my parents. Over the years, we've had, a, we've had an infinite amount of hilarious memories, and I could go on and on with those moments the two of us have experienced. For instance, her and me putting a pound of sugar in my spaghetti. It takes away the acidity, Samantha. Okay? Come on. It's sweet. No. <laughs> um, but instead, I'm going to talk about how that since I met her at 15, I have always been so impressed with her dedication and determination. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, I remember when she bought her first car at 16, moved out on her own at 18, and has been on her own since, never asking for help and doing what she needed to do so she could put herself through school and pay her bills. Now, it's taken me a while to realize, and I just recently thought about it, but looking up here at her bridesmaids, there's a total of four girls standing there to support her and Hugh getting married. And if you were to ask us individually who our best friend is, we would all point to Samantha. To me, that should show everyone the type of person she is. Dedicated, trustworthy, loyal, selfless, <laughs> loving, and so much more. These are all traits that, in my opinion, are necessary for marriage to succeed. And she will show all of these to Hugh, and even better, their children. <clears throat> and he will, and in turn, and then they will be forever best friends. So, Samantha, thank you for being my best friend and standing next to me in front of God when I got married and being a wonderful aunt to my children. I am honored to stand next to you today and make even greater memories with you. I'm sorry. <laughs> Cheers to Samantha and you, Mr. I love you. Many years. You are Samantha. All right, thank you, Cheryl. You did quite nicely. I'm sorry, everyone. Hope you're all having a lovely evening, and I'd like to thank you all for coming out and celebrating with us tonight. My name is Sarah, and I met Sam over six years ago while working together at so We became fast friends and inseparable. We've had many adventures together, and she has been my soul sister from day one. She's 
She's an amazing aunt and second home to my kids. Literally, people used to think we were both their moms. <laughs> she has been in her thick and thin, even biohazardous situations. But we'll think that's for her another time. Through everything, we became best friends. I will never forget the first time Sam met you. We went to a Gators game to meet him, and while in true Samantha style, it rained, so we all shared a pizza box to escape the rain because we were not doing that field. From the first meeting, I knew something was special about their relationship. Sam had met her first turn. He was handsome, smart, kind, funny. Sorry, but I can't remember what else you told me to say. <laughs> but in all seriousness, we knew from that encounter we were going to change the world and sweep Sam off her feet. I also knew that you had been a forever third wheel. <laughs> Samantha and you, where do I begin? I wish you to a marriage full of laughter, love, excitement, and joy. Always remember to keep God first in your marriage and never forget about all the place. Now, can we please all raise our glasses high in the air? Love is a friendship that has caught fire. May your love burn bright for years to come. Here's my best friend and her new best friend. And you last with the cheers many, many years.